Hello guys, it's Alessand Radek from European Coffee Trip and we are still in London. And today we are going to visit our friend Martin Hudak and we are going to taste some coffee cocktails with him. So we are close, it's Bataman Street. It should be in this street. So we are inside of the Cafe Belvedere. This is a pop-up cafe opened by Vodka Belvedere and our friend Martin Huda was responsible for all the coffee cocktails that are here and you were responsible actually about all the places. Yeah, right? so, so it's all about feelings and emotions. So it's all together, not just drinks, but how it looks, how you feel and now we're gonna drink something. So welcome in the Cafe Belvedere, as you can see. Uh, we have uh, this small coffee pop-up only for four days during London Fashion Week. And it's a cool combination, fashion, coffee, cocktails, all together, together with you guys and myself, we can try the cocktails, which I think are kind of cocktails representing the future. So uh, we have on the menu uh, four different connections. And the first one will be espresso martini, but we call it express. This is, this is the fastest espresso martini. And if you don't know, very famous classic coffee cocktail espresso martini was born in Soho, where we are right now. So thus, I invite you today to try my new interpretation of espresso martini. Because what we did, we pre-made all together, we put it in a siphon flask and charged with NL2. So basically it's kind of portable way how to make espresso martini. You just take a bottle and you put it in your glass. Fast, easy and tasty. Yeah, enjoy. The second one will be very popular espresso and tonic. Of course, we know that trend 10 years ago coming back from Spain and southern part of Europe. But I was thinking, how can I do this more approachable in cold London in February? So we add a little bit of ginger syrup from freshly squeezed ginger, touch of verge juice, which is freshly pressed grape juice, touch of vodka, tonic water, and a little bit of batch brew coffee on top. Very light, easy to drink, a little bit spicy, high ball style to drink. <laughs> so spicy, once again, dry. And the third one, I think one of the biggest challenges in my life, if you think about the coffee and cocktails, everything, everything was done before but how we can change perception, how we look on the future of the coffee cocktails. And I think using vegetables, it's something never been done before. So that's why I'm using uh, fresh beetroot juice, because beetroot is very popular in Poland, as well in Slovakia, where I'm coming from. So I use a beetroot juice, blend it together with raspberries, so give more fruitiness to the coffee, a touch of sugar. The freshly made espresso from Colombia, slightly washed citrusy flavor, vodka, shake it up, and that's a beetroot flat white. Kind of cheeky name, you might expect flat white, hot beverage with the milk as we know, but this is completely different. It's red, it's on an earthy note, it has this vegetal notes, sweetness and berry flavor from raspberries. I think it's fantastic. And then, of course, you can have a simple vodka itself or you can have a simple coffee. Very unusual, but I think healthy. Healthy and fresh. It's like, yeah, it, it feels like really fresh and healthy drink. Yeah. So you don't even realize there's any alcohol. So yeah, and it's not overly sweet as classic espresso martini. It's not the thick, it's not the syrupy, but it's more on the fresh side. That's what we're gonna achieve. And the red color, you know. Uh, cold brew gimlet. So we use a cold brew coffee. We add a little bit of sugar, we infuse it with the lime peels, so we create beautiful citrusy and sweet, delicate cold brew concentration. We add vodka and stir it. Two ingredients, simple as that. No additives, no covering, simple. Just wanna, you know, a little bit change perception how we look at the coffee cocktails. They don't need to be necessarily brown, hot, sticky, sweet, but they can look like that. What was the big, best part about it, like being part of this? You project? know what is the best part? Go inside and have a look. Have a look on those people. It's just insane. Everyone's drinking coffee cocktails. No one knows who I am. No one knows I did them. And they're enjoying them. And I'm going around and I see their faces. Everyone is happy and everyone looking like, oh wow, this is espresso martini. Oh, beetroot. They are like shocked, you know. And it's just, it's amazing to challenge. To challenge our hospitality, our industry. But as well to challenge the guests, the way how they look on the coffee cocktails. Because sometimes they think they're overly sweet, thick and heavy. And they must be with lots of sugar. No, no, no. It's, it's 2018 and we want to bring something new. If you go inside and look on the faces of those people, 
how they look on the drinks, just fantastic. I think that's the best, I think best feedback I can get, which is amazing. Good, good. Thank you. Ciao. Ciao. Thank you for staying. Yeah. Bye, guys. See you. Great guys. Bye bye. <laughs> All right, so that's it. Alish, how to end up this episode? Yeah, well, <laughs> so many coffee cocktails we tried and each of them was very, very tasty. So thank you, Martin, for invitation and for creating this coffee cocktails menu for Cafe Belvedere. And yeah, we can close it now. Really. Perfect. Thank you guys for watching. If you like this video, smash the like button, subscribe, and we'll see you next week. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>